I'm the product manager for the Bradley infantry fighting vehicle. I'm with PEO Ground Combat Systems here today fielding the Bradley A4 system. Now, right now we're in the middle of doing the operational uh, new equipment training for the Bradley crews. So they're going to learn about all the new capabilities and how to operate this new Bradley A4. And they can finalize that with a gunnery and they will be fully qualified to be the first unit in the Army to operate the A4. The main difference that the, the units are going to see right away is the powertrain. The uh, new engine we put in there provides a significant amount more, more ho horsepower, there's a new transmission. So the whole new powertrain is going to allow the vehicle to be much more maneuverable. Uh, as, as vehicles aged over the past decades, we've added additional armor onto it. So now we need to give it additional engine power in order to make it so it can keep up with uh, the other units in the ABC. The new Bradley A4 also has new uh, power uh, generation system. So as we put new electronics in the vehicle, we've had to have more power to distribute it throughout the vehicle. Technology's gotten a lot better, the way we use power is a lot better. So this new Bradley can support a bunch of new survivability, like uh, new counter IED technology uh, that we put on there, potentially in the future, uh, new um, active protection systems and new network capability. The technology in this new A4 will make sure that it is a dominant infantry fighting vehicle uh, for, for many years to come while we wait for OMFV. Uh, this will give the capability to soldiers to ensure that they can uh, maintain combat dominance.